I got 99 problems, but a pool ain't one. Used to be a problem, not anymore. Glad I switched that up. Joke's on you, I don't even go to the swimming pool. Main reason is because I don't like taking my shirt off. Second reason is, yeah, I just don't like taking my shirt off. Today, guys, we're gonna be checking out this video titled, After This Video, You Will No Longer Swim In The Pool. I know, right? You guys might be shocked. This is not a musical video. Calm down. Just chill. I got you. Anyway, guys, before we start, though, I wanna give a quick notification shout out to Lucy Nicole. Thank you so much, Lucy McCulley, for having on your buzz notification. Make sure you guys turn on my notifications for a notification shout out. Just comment on every single video as soon as I post it. And follow me on Instagram. I posted a new photo. Go check it out. Link down below. But anyway, guys, let's go find out why we should never go swimming in a swimming pool once again. I mean, this video has 4 million views in like a month. Like, there has to be good reasoning. Hi, friends. You're watching the UFAC Jam. Did he just say hi, friends? I've never had a friend before. When you are tormented by heat, the first thing that comes to your mind is to go swimming. Uh, well, not really, just maybe not leave my apartment, but mm, swimming's next, I say. Unfortunately, not everyone has the opportunity to go to the sea. Uh -huh. so many like me, I live, no, I live near no ocean, bro. I got rivers and lakes, so that's pretty much it. There's pools and apple parks. I don't go to pools, uh-uh. Oh hell no, nah, bro. I ain't trying to listen to five-year-olds scream and cry the whole time. However, such places of relaxation are fraught with dark sides. Which okay. will definitely cause you to be disgusted. Well, looking at myself shirtless, I'm already feeling like that. Alright. If you don't want to miss our new videos, subscribe to our channel. Yo, yeah, everyone subscribe to Mitchell Reacts right now for the best content on all of YouTube Land. Well. Mm-hmm. And subscribe to UFact. I don't know, they seem cool so far. He called his friends and yeah, let's subscribe. It's useless to deny and hide that people do this in the pool. According to anonymous. What? A little bit of doo doo, a little bit of pee pee. Survey: One out of five people pee in the pool when swimming there. One out of five? Oh my god! You know they put a chemical in the pool that turns urine blue. No, 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 it's an old, an old five tail, sweetie. No five tail. Oh my. One out of five people pee in the pool, bro. That means when you guys are swimming, there, if there's like, I don't know. 50, 60 people in the pool, there's at least like 20 people pooing in it. I mean, <laughs> peeing in it, I mean, bro, that's disgusting. This is especially true of little children. They do this dirty business involuntarily. Oh. But these statistics are not Thank God I don't go to the pool, bro. I'd rather just go swimming in a river or a lake, to be honest with you. Because many are simply too ashamed to admit it. Let's yeah. check our statistics. Write in the comments whether you urinated in the pool or think it's disgusting. I think it's disgusting. Did I do it a few times? Oh, yes, I did. But do I think it's wrong? Yep. I'd say I'm almost a criminal. It would seem that people have become more civilized recently, but it would be a mistake to think that. Civilized? Well, you some Planet of the Apes, dude? You crazy? They'll show a high level of bacteria, which prove only one thing. People openly defecate in the water or do not observe the rules of personal hygiene. In most pools, fecal bacteria such as E. coli and others are found in the analysis. Are you kidding me? I'm sorry, if I have some swimmers who do like swim meets and stuff watching this video, I want to apologize, dude. I'm sorry, but this is wrong. This colon bacillus can cause disorders and sometimes diarrhea. Oh my god. In other words, maybe the person did not do it in the pool, but before swimming he went to the toilet and, pardon, badly wiped. Oh That's my god. Thank god I don't go to I'm never going to another swimming pool in my life. No, the E. coli swims with all. You may ask whether why the chlorine doesn't kill these bacteria. Well, because it just doesn't have the time. After all, the What do you mean chlorine doesn't have the time? What does it do? It just sits in the pool all day. I don't pretty I'm pretty sure chlorine doesn't even sleep. They're up 24 hours in the same spot. Why, why don't they have time? This is not instantaneous. It happens only after about 30 minutes or so. So be careful and try not to swallow the water. Blech. Thank you for saying that. I've only swallowed the water 10 million times every time I went swimming. Ear infections and rashes are infections that you can catch in swimming pools. Ear infections? Is that why I'm half deaf? 
I, guys, here's a fun fact about me. When I was a kid, I used to go to the swimming pool every single day. Um, when I was a little kid, I was in swim lessons for like two years. I was actually very, very, very good at swimming. Uh, I got to like the highest level you could go in. So basically, I'm like lifeguard level, bro. I never became a lifeguard because I'm sitting in my chair doing this, but I'm basically lifeguard level. So if you guys ever see me in real life swimming, just know. If you're having difficulty swimming, I'm going to be a lifeguard, dude. Unless I see a shark or something, I'm out of there, dude. You're on your own. So it's caused by bacteria in the water. And all this is compounded by local hypothermia. As a result, if you neglect to get treatment for these infections, you can get purulent otitis or even lose your hearing. Oh my god. That... Comment down below if you're ever going swimming again. This is nuts. Just go to pools and rivers, guys. Like, seriously. I mean, no, not pools. Oceans, lakes, go there. I mean, sure, there's animals and stuff in there, but, like, dude, I'm pretty sure they're low-key a little cleaner. Chlorine is added to the pools to fight infections. It kills infections, but not so quickly. However, there's a flip side of the coin. When ingested, chlorinated water can cause various diseases, including cancer. And oh my the god. And of the chlorine fumes that evaporate from these heated pools can cause asthma, allergies, and other respiratory diseases. Oh, crap. Are you guys thinking this in, bro? This is actually nuts. And, of course, our skin suffers. How are pools even legal? After hearing all this, like, how is it even a thing? Irritation and itching are not uncommon cases after swimming in pools. That is actually insane. I'm kind of, I kind of wish I didn't watch this because, you know, what if in the future I did go to a pool? I don't want to go swimming, dude. Okay, what what is going on here? Did this man go swimming? Another He's a lizard, doesn't he belong in the water? That you can catch in the public pools is a fungus. The skin on the legs can be covered with bubbles and itch, and oh your nails my. will turn yellow, start to delaminate, and will look awful. I'm pretty sure my nails are already doing that. Treatment for fungus is very long, so follow these rules. Yep. Use only your own slippers and towels. Only your own? I would never use someone else's slippers. Are you out of your mind? Don't go barefoot near the pool or in the shower. Don't go barefoot near the pool? 100% of people do that. Who doesn't go barefoot near a pool? Treat your skin and toenails with antifungal ointment before and after the pool. Don't visit pools if you have a cold. Because your body will be weakened and vulnerable to infection. <laughs> Okay. Uh, yeah, I did swim in pools often, you fact. And guess what? Never again. I'm gonna sip a bit of my coffee right now. I don't really drink tea, it's just coffee, but that was nuts. Never going swimming again. Never going near chlorine again. As a matter of fact, I don't even know what I was gonna say. I'm just really upset right now. If you guys enjoyed my reaction though, please hit that like button for me. Tell me down below, like I said, if you guys are ever going to go swimming or not again. Or if you guys do swimming for like, you know, a sport. Like are you in swim lessons or are you in comp competitive swimming? Like dude, I feel bad for you son. I got 99 problems but a pool ain't one. It used to be a problem, not anymore. Glad I switched that up. But anyway guys, also make sure you guys follow me on all my social media links are down below. Cop that Mitchell Reacts merch, tspring.com slash store slash Mitchell Reacts, bruh. Look at this shirt's supposed to be baggy, bro. But I'm literally so ripped that it's like tight on me, dude. God, I'm turning into a monster. I'm actually a douchebag now that I think about it. Okay, we're done, dude. I'm wrapping up the video. I love you guys. Peace.